Uh, I've heard those that have called for resignation. I'm not calling for it. I'm just calling to vote her out and vote me in. Senatorial candidate Mike Espy open about his views on his opponent's controversial joke about public hangings. Espy oddly avoided local media for days as Cindy Hyde Smith's comments and reaction dominated headlines. After being asked six times to explain it, to clarify whatever she didn't. Okay, so uh, then I think it's even worse. I mean, it just seems to me that, that right now political leaders think that uh, humility is some kind of form of weakness. You know, to apologize or to say I'm sorry or to forgive me, I made a mistake. Some don't want to do that because it's a sign of weakness, they think. I really think it's a sign of strength. Cindy Hyde-Smith has been under fire for saying she would sit on the front row of a public hanging to apparently humor Tupelo voters at a small campaign gathering earlier this month. The former Secretary of Agriculture strong in his rebuke of her comments, yet very careful not to push a radical agenda. So what I'm trying to do is be the candidate that reaches across and brings everyone over together. I'm not going to dwell on this as a racial issue. What I'm trying to do is make sure everyone understands that we may have come over here on different ships, but we're all in the same boat now. Education, health care, job development, um, pre-existing conditions, all of these are issues that are primary here in Mississippi. Secretary Espy was invited to speak at the Working Together Jackson Forum Wednesday. Every month, a diverse coalition of business and community leaders meet to talk about a progressive agenda. Sarah Campbell with the organization. Working Together Jackson and Working Together Mississippi will not tolerate any words or actions that impede these goals by degrading any person or group. We urge the candidates in this special election to rise above the history of racism that has too often been a part of public life. Secretary Espy recently accepted a November 20th debate against Cindy Hyde-Smith. He plans to show her weakness on health care issues since being appointed. This is the number one issue in Mississippi today, health care. We have all these uh, rural hospitals closing because our leadership in Mississippi did not accept the Medicaid expansion money that was offered to it a couple years ago. And those chickens are coming home to roost. Hyde Smith plans to rally her supporters by painting Espy as a liberal Democrat. Espy says he's actually an independent and has a history of working with Republicans. The runoff election is November 27th. Eric Walker, JSU-TV.